Don't flop revival, we're back in Manchester, make a bit of noise. Rapper to my left, introduce yourself. Liz O. Thanks, Same thing, one of the other one main channel battles of the day, MC on my right hand side, let them know you are, let's go. Yo, Sleepy G, uh, COVID shut down EPs out now, South Point. Someone make some noise, please. Yeah. Let's go. See, I hope you're all prepared for a battle that could be quite major. Because it's Mr. Cheesier Than Five Graters versus the 05 Preston Scene of Grime Saviour. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. It's gonna take more than any info that you will read from the pages that I wrote as just a team. Because that chapter's closed, it isn't me. I ain't someone you can open up and read like I was broken at the seams. I thought I might be a bit further with my progress in this league. But that's why they gave me this opponent to defeat. Because you can read about success on any inspiring quote that you will see that says I need to cut down sleep to get me closer to my dreams. Well, mm. this account down to your demolition. Prepare to get blown in three, cause he might have hopes and dreams to be a pro overseas, but they only show for sleep if the shows are free, I know the league and have my host and have my sights set on the whole field like a CM Punk, so if he's provoking me or wants to know it's beef, then I'll be throwing knees if I go to sleep, mm. so, yeah, it's crazy, claims he being magic and Jay Pro at writing, but it's all lazy content in his quotes and schemes, cause I don't believe you've ever wrote anything close to a Chiller Jones or Loaded Please, today's name is fitting though, cause it's like he snooze but I'm being shown repeat, cause even if you prep for work it's too late, and now you oversleep. Mm. Yeah. So if you're looking for an easy win, then trust me, this move isn't the sweetest. Cause money just containing the cake inside the zoo, keeping this beast. And there's no way I lose and they see me defeated. So we can play a little game. But if you don't finish Jigsaw, it's a box with you leaving in pieces. If this mm. cat nap is lights out, I show him what the true meaning of sleep is. This body getting massacred, so bad that every newsreader is speechless. He might be from Brighton, but this goon's peers are the weakness. Cause what's guys that will coast lines against a shore killer like Tunisian beaches. Mm. <laughs> your, your real name is Jay McDougal. <laughs> <laughs> Time. <laughs> <laughs> you know you're getting sun today, right? Well, just be happy, G, because this the way it has to be. Get this sort of thing twisted, then then shit could get dismantled like an Allen key. If this one of these Star Wars, he's getting sun. So if he then runs back for beef, he'll end up sun twice, like watching sun rise on Tatooine. Mm -hmm. Brings it. Oh, What's happening, G? <laughs> <laughs> you really thought Bizzo was the matching candidate to stand with me? <laughs> Well, I'm glad I ain't into the politics, bro. I'ma stand back and breathe. Cause he's getting marked and boxed out for the count. That's a ballot sheet. You really thought Bizzo was the man to rap with me? Nah, he just hits flatline after flatline. Someone give a call to casualty. It ain't difficult to battle B cause you're so fucking boring, bruv. 10,000 times as bad as me, so the facts we see. <laughs> after you're done round, the judges and crowd are all feeling sleepy, so looks like I got this one in the bag automatic. <laughs> Cause you're so fucking boring, bruv. Have you ever seen the Bizzo battle? Man, that shit's depressing. Mm -hmm. Going on like he's Achilles with angles. Well, Achilles angles. The right ankle slick could dead it. Watch his stock drop when a box tops. Now his market has a big depression. I'm bringing that illness back. Let's see if this biz can handle this recession. Mm -hmm. when, when Briggs first suggested this, I thought, God, this a body. God body. This about to get oh so mythic. I'm working through my labours with this. Watch Hercules go the distance with a flow deeper than Jack Cousteau when he's going swimming. Mm -hmm. You're so predictable, biz. Your mind's like a glass dome. I could take one peek and know what's in it So before these quotes are finished Now I'm making wrecking balls out of both my fists And swinging for that big glass dome like Homer Simpson mm. <laughs> You probably guessed already, this an ace mate The A game's what I'm serving up Stay blind to the truth of that <laughs> Curtains cuss, try comedy, you won't body me So whatever words he does when them little words are done He'll be trying really fucking hard not to speak about the war Like Basil 40 when the Germans come <laughs> 
You look like the type of pussy to steal a purse and then run. <laughs> then get nervous halfway through and sprint back to return the funds. <laughs> This man, this biz man can't profit. Sink your money into this biz, that's a bad deposit. Watch how quickly his value starts dropping. You barely scratched the surface off this scene, biz. Now nah, you just tap dance off it. First round, this shit was light work, like a bad bars topic. Sleep. <laughs> 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 See this bread is so self-obsessed in battles. You really have a troubled mind. Rather rectify your past performances more than rapping at the other guy. I don't think you won your last battle, bro. So this will chill your heart another time. Cardiac arrest, you just use shocks to bring back that buzz to life. See, shocks was direct and hit harder, so technically he won the fight. So if you spit twice as much content that's nowhere near as good, then that doesn't make it fucking right. So Sleepy's explained like Harry shot as world record. And if you will wonder why, it's cause he beat the better rapper by only spitting double time. So, so fuck your one battle. Cause your entire game plan to beat him was a travesty. But there's one part in a long line of events that really does embarrass me. In his last round, Sleepy braces the crowd for what he plans to be the madder scheme and says, he uses the persona and acts sarcastically, but to me it's the fake persona and sarcasm that's covering up the chasms in his personality. Exactly, the reaction was as flat as we speak. <laughs> Exactly, the reaction was as flat as we speak. Not a single laugh or a clap from a fan could be seen. So then you turn to the staff of the league and say, and it's really not a day for bars, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Get a fucking that rap did you have any, G? I've never seen a battle so whack in this scene, but this rapper believes what he actually spat could compete and would have the chance to perhaps be declared the champ up in Leeds. Bro, the only thing that was magic to me is how you could turn a wardrobe into a library in a matter of ease. <laughs> See, opponents always mention my performance, but the angle's getting weak. But when I'm unmotivated, it's below the basics. So today, you'll see these man envy me. But you, you're so lethargic in your style. It's like you plan to get beat. And we're sick of that tired presence, so maybe you'd win more if you had any sleep. See, you just look around the crowds and beg the fans to get what you planned on. Your flow of roller coaster. Those punches will rise, but then jam at the top when you're expected to land one. You lose the bars for support, but we all just endlessly hang on, and that doesn't ride well, so you crash, leaving no leg to stand on. Woo! Oh, so, Robbie's about to turn sour fast, because when the battlers in this league were baptized with talent, it's as if you wore that shower cap. Because <laughs> we're bored of enduring those non-performing zero punchline hour raps So you can see how I'm finished with sleeping minutes like a power nap Fuck him, he repped a, he repped a team called Soapbox and he's a big appeal But Soapbox sure to race downhill and crash if you get sleepy at the wheel mm. so, quit go, let's go. so quit trying to act a tyrant with it Three words to describe his image, a shy wet timid When he raps it's weak jabs, you wouldn't see them Killing me softly if it was Wyclef singing So claiming in this ring you'll be sting like an Fist. That just invites them critics, cause you are lead today. Those punches shaky and there's no fight left in him. Ooh. And your real name is Jay McDougall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm throwing far too many punches for Biz to block or parry. So I'm gonna spend a little time at the start of this round breaking down the biz history, like reviewing an office tax sheet. You only got to the second round of your top eight because you didn't battle the proper tally. You then proceeded to go off and get bodied by Connor Harry, then went off to Manny where he lost to Sean O'Mac proper badly, even slipped up versus the man Blitz. Damn biz, was the plan B? Because we saw that little W versus verbal, but be honest man, please, you never really sung the kid like a foster family. Now, I rock with Harry. But you know I love a bit of grime, me. <laughs> so I don't give a flying fuck what Heretic said. I want to know every single thing there is to know about the Preston grime scene. <laughs> like that one time there was that one grime rave that Skepta said he might reach. <laughs> <laughs> or that other time one person from Preston got a retweet from Wiley. <laughs> I'm joking, the Preston grime scene. Whoop! The shit is mad, the shit is mental. 
I mean, who the fuck wouldn't want to see you and three of your best mates in a pub doing karaoke over the rhythm and gash instrument? <laughs> <laughs> the Preston Grimes scene. He's still got it in his bio, so for some reason he still reps it. Why is that? That shit in serious need of fresh air. That old scene's diaphragm's diaphragm a diaphragm. You've been a diehard supporter of Mustard. Today you're gonna die a fan. I'm eating heavy today, coming straight off that diet plan. Ask me to join your little grimy crew? Man, I'm straight declining that. Cause my shit lethal. Biz will catch a pal for trying to rep a fire camp. <laughs> and I kinda like the fact this event called Revival at the Zombie Shack. Cause I've been making music, support, performing again and the support has been blessed. So it's a little bit awkward when Bizzo's awful attempts at performing the remess cause he performed poor in the flesh. I could have thrown out any one of my dubs in a sound clash. And it would have straight slaughtered this dragon, and tore him to shreds, yeah. I could throw any dub out at the zombie shack. And I can guarantee you will get a little slice of that vinyl stored in your head. Like the scene after they break down the door to the shed in Shaun of the Dead. <laughs> Boring at best, your style boring, please update it, change the cassette. Your performance been awful, get that cadence in check. But I'm only here because I'm performing on Nasty FM tomorrow. So this is me bodying Bizzo on the way to a set. Sleep. <laughs> Last week was the toughest it gets. Cause the moment you see that someone's upset, your heart starts to beat so rough in your chest. You wheeze every couple of best breaths and you feel that your stomach's in shreds. And I could see that this wasn't pretend before. Bad news was feeding through my loved ones and friends and I was told that one of my dearest of uncles was dead. See, this week wouldn't come to an end. It seemed that to come to the stress, but I plead for one bit of strength to believe that was good at the end. But, ah, I believe that was good at the end. Ah, fuck, to believe that was good at the end. I couldn't, but, I, could, I couldn't give a fuck if I seem a bit under with prep I could have cancelled this battle with ease But I can see something from the rubble that's left There's a reason it's you I've been put up against A hidden meaning which has got me believing that I've been subtly blessed Cause if I'm facing you and sleep is the cousin of death Then watch as I take him out to seek my fucking revenge yeah, so, so yeah, yeah I might have slipped but now I'm back and there won't be a robbery Cause they'll agree, they'll all see from Oh fuck Yeah I'm back but there won't be a robbery cause they'll Oh, man, Yo, so peep showmanship and let's see what sleep loaded with a stopgap rapper blocking your path so it snow likes if it's beast mode he's in all flat lines from Brighton so I'll steamroller him cause you were brought up around fruits like a green grocer so bitch you'll need, <laughs> you'll need hope for this like three clovers cause even your team know your shit but don't bring them in but don't bring them around money cause if they're seen throwing fists we'll turn them to insomniacs cause they might lose sleep over this see my lines see each line's dope like snow white mine diamond sleep you ain't big in size my I rhyme book, mad dog, to match this you'd need to give the San Andreas mission tries I couldn't give a fuck if he's nice, he's overhyped and this isn't right Cause he likes story hunters, all cheap content but still bidding high Cause he believes he marketed at a bigger price on Twitter every minute He's bigging up a different guy, Kylie Jenner challenge All that sucking up wants me to make his lips go big in size <laughs> for Sterling, so why'd you come to Man City guy? Cause the only way you'll see the round sway to go sleepy is if the judges are all hypnotised. Mm. Shit, it's a real name battle round. <laughs> 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 Bizzo's awful music is all sorts of stupid. Them shitty pop trap flows be leaving deep beats wrecked. Bizzo be running around fucking up more shit in the lab than when I watch cartoons as a lad and saw Dee Dee's mess. <laughs> <laughs> this my performance if you want, how I'm so Americanized in the way Sleepy G step. Well mate, my performance my own and I call that the Sleepy G step. <laughs> in all them billions of selfies you take, why are you always suited and tied? Cause we ain't suited to tie, this teacher student time to learn I'm just here up in his stock value, get it? This teacher student, Pinkman to Heisenberg You sound like me, but if I was worse I'm, <laughs> I'm here to break the biz structure down just to redefine his worth Cause that style of wear out, floral patterns like rocking Hawaiian shirts Shirty boy, I know you were nervous as fuck pre-battle Matey knows his shaky flows ain't tight he been in the mirror throwing up pre bow Ha! You're the Koj type! <laughs> <laughs> when you take this next L, you're worth a wither. So a loss won't play right when I take a third off the top of the biz value like a wholesale price. Oh wait, I saw what you said. You joined the gym because you wanted to make some new friends. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> That's a little bit bent, mate. <laughs> 
Cause doing all them extra reps won't leave you with any rep gauge. You're dead weight. Wanna throw your weight around best train. Break a leg or catch a leg break. Cause nobody in the world gives a flying fuck when you make a five paragraph Facebook status <laughs> attempting to explain that you're a little bit tired because yesterday was leg day. <laughs> <laughs> Today. Check our resumes, this isn't close, so don't spit some shitty punchline and then try tell me it's a joke, cos I spit venom me and I'ma bring carnage to a comic cos I take a body like when Eddie Brock met the sin for y'all. Biz up, bro, you best bow down, you're from near here, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, this ain't your hometown crowd now, your performance been awful this season, so what Manny's feeling right about now is that he weren't worth Manny's money like Radamel Falcao. <laughs> from a similar crop biz, but we ain't in a similar spot. You're just another little face on the list of names I'm ticking off. Biz old dead today. Yeah, he's getting left in a box by Mr. Jump to mid-tier from the 13 filler crop. <laughs> <laughs> Boo town. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna give it a shot and sweet. I thought it was a neck and neck battle, but I have to give a winner. And I'm gonna put it down to Biz old choke. Sleepy G. Give it Sleepy 3 though. Yo, it's Coach Yeah, I'm just uh, Sleepy G and Bizzo, man. It was a really, really close battle, man. Uh, I had it 1-1 one, one going into the third. Uh, but it, it, like, there was no room for mistakes in that even. And just Bizzo had that choke in the third, so I'm going to give it 2-1 to Sleepy G. What's good? This is Don't Flop Manchester, Don't Flop Revival. We're back with one of the Don't Flop main channel battles of the day. My man Bizzo going up against Sleepy G. Unanimous vote from all the judges picking up another win at Sleepy G. Being stalked. <laughs> hey, everything you cooked, everything you cooked is on a George Foreman. Everything you wear is George for men. <laughs>